What up, y'all? It's your man, Apple American. Take two. Um, the second time I'm trying to do this video. Uh, I was having a conversation with Guy King. I talked to him a lot on WhatsApp. You know, we were talking about different conversations about uh, the current state of the SMP, the sexual marketplace. And uh, the topic of single mothers came up and whatnot and their influence on women who don't have children and the mentality and how this can become a multi-generational thing, you know, if it runs in a family, you know. Um, but that brought me to something else actually entirely different. It was weird just the way my head works. Um, and I was thinking about my whole topic with MGTO and all this stuff and how these guys are technically eradicating themselves from the genetic lineage of humanity by being MGTO and not having kids and whatnot and this, that, the other, not dealing with women. And again, I said, that's their choice. You know, if that's what they want to do, that's what they want to do. But then I thought about it. It's an absolute must when we think about it that there has to be a counterbalance in every human action. And there is, you know, they say there's with every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. And this stands true, actually, when you really look at anything in the natural world. And I thought about all these women out here freezing their eggs and not having kids, you know, looking for the right guy, but never finding the right guy, never having kids. And they're the exact opposite. They're the counterbalance to MGTO. They just don't know it. They, they're technically women going their own way without going their own way. Let me explain. If a woman, the primary function of a woman, whether women want to hear this in the 21st century or not, the entire function and premise of their body is to reproduce another human being. That is the primary biological function of their body. It's a huge, huge craving for men to reproduce just like it is for women. That's what you're made for. You know, the entire, they're a specialty. They're females. They are specially built to reproduce the, op you know, another generation of human beings. Now, when they don't have kids, they technically, although they're having sex and whatnot and dating, they're still technically in a sense, work with me here, they're, they're, they're almost incels, you know, inv involuntarily celibate. They're not celibate, but in a reproductive sense, they are. They're involuntarily able or capable of finding a partner that they consider to be worthy of having a kid with and then don't have kids. And so just like MGTO, they eradicate themselves from the human genome. It's a beautiful cleansing that's taking place right now in humanity. I, it struck me and it is amazing. When you think about it, the worst of humanity are voluntarily not having children from amongst the women. Those are the hoes and the ones that are out there, you know, just sucking and can left and right. They're the worst of humanity. Whether you like to admit it or not, hoes ain't no good. OK, we do have hoes that are having kids, but those ones out there with that horrible mentality, the feminists and whatnot. OK, some feminists do have kids, but you get what I'm saying. Work with me here. This is just a concept that popped in my head. They're not having kids. And then those men out there who don't have the internal rah rah to go out and like, you know, run into the market, into the battlefield and see what it takes to, you know, find that one particular woman. It's not going to do them over because they're not all bad. There is no Nawalt and there is no Awalt. There's exceptions. There's norms. You just got to do your part and you got to find and put in your efforts. And eventually that one will be there. You know, I'm not purple pilling you. I'm not telling you, you know, go blue pill or whatever else. But if you put in your efforts in your work and you learn some basic game and you're you're taking care of yourself. You're taking care of your career and whatnot. You know, you're going to find that lady out there. It's not going to want to like jam you up. It's going to be out there because you're going to be in her environment. The best and the highest at her, AKA her hypergamous maxim. And she's not going to mess that up. So anyway, moving on back to the topic, these women are the equivalent of incels and the MGTOW who won't reproduce. And when we look at this, man, we got the guys who don't have that internal fortitude to like go forth and they're not reproducing. Awesome. We got those women out there who are just like a hot mess mentally and psychologically, hypergamously unchecked, you know, and they're a hot mess and they're not reproducing. Right now, humanity is going through an amazing cleansing. We don't actually need, like I said in my previous video, an environment where you're allowed to hack your enemies and horrible terrible people to pieces although that would be nice also we could accelerate things greatly it's taking place already hacking people up is just so i don't have to deal with them in my face daily but when you think about the next generation or the lack thereof oh this is a beautiful thing man it's happening right now this is amazing this is amazing there's a balance gentlemen there's a balance i told you the environment right now the sexual marketplace 
the environment that exists right now, it's not going to exist in, in another decade because there's only going to be those people who had fortitude and those people who had the values or family values that are going to be left over. All of these crazy like, you know, PUAs and this one's and that one's who aren't having kids, they're going to disappear in a generation. Wonderful. It's wonderful, gentlemen. The future looks bright. Just got to see the silver lining. That's all it is, man. See now Ling Ling and Becky playing games here. See? What? You see these two? These two? These two? <laughs> Let me go deal with this, man. This is your man, Alvo Mary. Catch me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. Catch me on. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, what? Bit shoot. Uh, all at Alvo American. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. I'm out. What the... It